What's up guys? And uh, I'm back with an all new uh, video of music pickups and got three CDs, a CD box set, and two vinyl pickups here to show. First up are my uh, single CD pickups and these first two I got from Amazon. I uh, picked up uh, Ozzy Osbourne's Speak of the Devil and little disappointed that there's no vinyl uh, release for this, but uh, I'm just glad I uh, got this finally. And uh, this is the only Ozzy live CD I have never heard. I've heard Tribute, uh, Just Say Ozzy, and the Live at Budokan CD, but not this one in Live at Loud. And this is uh, basically just a... Uh, live album of uh, Black Sabbath songs and it's a, a decent CD and this is the latest release from Ghost called um, Phantom Mime and it's a five song covers EP and it's got covers of Iron Maiden and Genesis and uh, covers from a couple other bands I'm not really familiar with and they also cover Tina Turner's We Don't Need Another Hero, which is pretty good. And this band gets uh, mixed uh, opinions, but uh, I enjoy them very much. This last CD pickup I got in the mail the other day, and this is the uh, debut release from Dieth. And uh, I hear this is how you pronounce the uh, band's name. This is To Hell and Back. And... This is the debut uh, from the uh, band featuring former Megadeth bassist Dave Elveson and uh, the lead singer who used to be in Entombed. And uh, this is, uh, it's kind of like melodic uh, death metal and uh, it's just a kick-ass CD. And uh, this is also very recommended. This next one's a CD box set I got from Noise International's website because I looked for the uh, CD box set on other websites and they just had the uh, vinyl uh, box set for pre-order and I just wanted to get it on CD and this is uh, Sabbath with, this is uh, Sabbath, oh, Sabbath's uh, Mad Dogs and Englishman and it's uh, Two of their studio EP, two of their studio CDs, a uh, live CD, a three song CD, and a DVD. And uh, this is the band's debut, um, Dreamweaver. No, A History of a Time to Come. And uh, it came with a free gift that I got, which is an embroidered patch. It's uh, upside down. Dreamweaver, which is the band's second one. They had a third one uh, on Noise, which I did some Wikipedia searching, but uh, it's not included in this box set, which I don't know why. A live CD, live in East Berlin, 1990. His Infernal Majesty's Voice, which is a three-song EP, uh, kind of styled like a... Uh, 45 cover of a 45 and it's basically got the same songs on it and the uh, live DVD called the end of the beginning which is basically just the uh, live performance from East Berlin and came with a booklet and a uh, poster uh, of the uh, History of a Time to Come album. And uh, this band's uh, known for having uh, Andy Sneap on guitar, who I heard uh, produced uh, other metal bands later on, and I heard he was in uh, Judas Priest. Now for the uh, vinyl pickups, and uh, these are from uh, Earache Records' website, and... Uh, this is uh, Napalm Death's Fear, Emptiness, Despair on uh, white vinyl.
And uh, Brutal Truths uh, Need to Control on uh, Black Vinyl. And this is their uh, second release for the uh, label. And um, they later went on to uh, uh, Relapse Records. And uh, I think that band's still around. I know this is the band known for having uh, former uh, nuclear Anthrax Nuclear Assault bassist Dan Lilker, who later went back to Nuclear Assault. And uh, this is uh, classic uh, grindcore.